Let's see this case. This case is the next case that is case number 6. So I write here case 6 and we have to see it in detail. This case says that here intersection of the curve is with a point on the y-axis. That means we have f, f is what 0, f with the coordinate and the curve goes from downward to upward c to d, y is equal to c, y is equal to d. The curve is what? It is shown by the red ink and this is the coordinate axis. Here is the origin 0, this should be y dash and so on that you can do. So how to compute the area under this simple curve? We are going to see that this area would be composed of the tick mark that I have drawn, this shaded area plus this shaded area and these two add on and give me the whole of the area. But as you can see this is towards the left hand side, this is towards the right hand side. So what is towards the left hand side will be giving me a negative answer, what is towards the right will be giving me a positive answer. But what you have to do, don't have to panic and bother, simply take the modulus and arrive at the answer. So the total answer would be what? The answer for the area of this thing, that means suppose I name it as I1 plus the answer for I2 taking the modulus. The other thing, what kind of strips are we going to take? If I take the equation of the curve as x is equal to g of y because it is there that it is towards, we are talking about symmetricity about the y-axis. If we take it as x is equal to g of y, then the answer should be what? It should be integration x dy and the integration should be from first c to f and then from f to d. So that is how you do this kind of a question. You are going to take what kind of strips? Horizontal strips similar to the concepts we studied in the previous video. We will be solving questions on this case too.